where they began. Super Bowl Sunday means the top contenders are coming out to play. And we're not talking about the players on the field either. It's the commercials, of course. <laughs> because you don't get these kind of commercials during women's figure skating in the Olympics. We're going to be okay. <laughs> At nearly $3 million a spot, companies are waiting all year to put out their best. You know, we want to sit and see what, what's going to come up on the new commercials and the new endorsements, all of that. See what's going to be comical about everything. The commercials are just as important as the big game. Toby Anzalino waited until halftime to use the restroom, just so he didn't miss a single 30-second spot. Nah, you kind of hold it, you wait till halftime, you know, when you go through that, like, 45-minute, hour-long halftime, so you can sit here and watch all the commercials. You don't want to miss them. They're great. <laughs> and while battle lines have been drawn on favorite teams, everyone here has their favorite commercial. We like the Betty White commercial. Yeah, the Snickers. You're playing like Betty White out there. That's not what your girlfriend said. So far, the Doritos this year. The tasers. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> it's always the beer commercials. It's always the beer commercials. <laughs> Who knew you were so environmentally responsible? <laughs> oh, they're not empty. And while chips, dip, and a frosty beverage is a national pastime for Super Bowl Sunday, you can't help but think so are those commercials. Should probably retire after this. I don't know. Maybe. We don't know what things will be like 10 years from now. Thank you. But we can assure you that your Hyundai will still be covered. Introducing the all-new Hyundai.